BTS, thanks so much for clicking and welcome back to my channel if you're new welcome so in today's video i'm going to share with you hacks on how you can wear your off shoulder outfits your strapless outfits with a bra but then without the strap showing this hack is mostly for those people who have saggy girls and you know they just can't wear their outfits without a bra or they don't love tapes like personally i don't love tapes so guys if you try this hack and it works for you kindly leave your feedback in the comment section down below and let us know if it worked for you and also if you find this video helpful be sure to give it a thumbs up comment and don't forget to subscribe so guys most of the time this is how you wear your outfit especially again as i told you earlier especially if you have saggy boobs like it can just be uncomfortable wearing you know uh, like an off shoulder outfit or a strapless outfit without a bra so this is the bra that i had worn on my previous clips and the next clip that i'm going to show so as you can see it's just a normal look up bra nothing much not padded and these two outfits that I'm going to try the hacks on, they don't have like an underwire, so they're not going to support the bra of the girls. This is how I would wear my bra in my outfit. I just take the straps and hide them in the outfit, especially if the fabric is thick, so like no one is going to see the straps. And I don't always like remove the straps because just in case I need them later. I know this is what most of us do, just remove the straps from the yucca bra and wear it like that. But then remember, this hack is for those people who have like saggy girls. So like if you walk around, if you dance, like the girls won't be in the same position again. And you just won't have that confidence. So this is my first hack that I recommend, wearing a corset if you want your girls to be in the same position as long as you want them to be. So you're going to wear a corset. I'll, I'll be using this corset that I got from Amazon. I'll definitely put a link in the description box down below for this corset. It's actually one of my favorite. So you're going to wear your corset. You're still going to wear your bra, but then you have to add a corset. Like a corset is going to really support the girls and keep them in that position. And so these are the girls before, as you can see. And remember, I've not like moved around a lot, so the girls are still like in that position. I know some people who don't love corsets or waist trainers because they feel like they are uncomfortable, they are not breathable. But then you don't have to use the last hook; you can just use the first hooks. The aim is just to lift the girls and maintain them in that position. Using a waist trainer is always my favorite because, again, it just gives you that hourglass shape figure and lifts the girls at the same time. As you continue hooking the waist trainer up, you realize the girls are being lifted. And that's what I'm talking about. Pull the waist trainer slightly above the underwire and you'll just notice some difference. The girls won't go anywhere. They'll just be in that position. If you move around, if you dance, they'll just be in that position and you'll just feel confident. The corset is slightly on the underwire so that, you know, it just lifts the girls. Definitely, I can see some difference. I can feel some difference. And I just want you to comment down below, guys, if you can see some difference as well. So you don't have to use the exact corset that I use. You can as well use this other one. First of all, this one is also loose, but it just worked as the first one. Yeah, so you don't have to go for like a very tight corset. Any corset will work for this. So I've worn the corset and the black bra in this outfit and you can see it just looks so perfect even when I dance around like the girls are not going to go anywhere and I'm also feeling like you know my tummy is snatched. So if you've watched my previous videos on hacks, on tummy hacks, I've actually told you if you don't want your shapewear or your corsets or restrainers to be seen in your outfit then go for multicolored outfits. Like when you pair your, your shapewear, your butt lifters in multicolored outfit that they're not going to show at all. Like no one is going to notice that you know you've worn a shape in that outfit so for this uh, outfit i always wear it with the bright uh, with the straps but then if i can wear it like this without the straps then why not so guys just comment down below if this is a hack that you can try and this video is actually inspired by a photo that i saw on instagram at home i'm hoping i'll get that photo and share with you that photo there were like five bridesmaids they had worn a beige uh, gowns and uh, then one of them had worn a bra like the gown was strapless and then one of them had worn a black bra 
because because i could see the straps and then i thought like you know i'm just going to share with you this video maybe i might help someone out there you know to slay that amazing outfit in her closet <music> So this is the second hack wearing a padded yucca bra and i know this is what most of us use but then i'm just going to show you how i do it differently so as you can see it's padded so when it's padded it kind of helps lift the girls So this is how you're supposed to hook this bra but then this is what i always do i do it once in a while when i want to wear like an old shoulder outfit or a strapless outfit i always like make a knot at the back but then this is a disclaimer don't do this often you might stretch the wings too much and the bra will become loose but this is what i always do and it helps a lot and then also remember this is not something that you're supposed to do on every bra there are some bras that are the wings are too like they don't stretch that much so you won't be able to make a knot like this one I can't make a knot with this one. If I decide to make a knot with this one, it's going to be small, it might be too tight and uncomfortable. So just don't force it. For this, it can't work. But as you can see, even for this, after I made the knot at the back, it still stretches. So it's still going to be comfortable. And now I'm going to try it in this red outfit. So this is before tying the knots again. It's just it's just okay, but then the girls are not where I want them to be. And this is after. So I think you can see some difference. This one is lifted and the girls look better than they were before. I've worn the same bra in this outfit again but then when it comes to this outfit just go for a bra that is v-shaped at the cleavage area and then you can wear it with the, with the straps just pull the straps uh, and hide the straps in the sleeve my last hack is wearing a body shaper dress that has like a brown knit So that was it for today guys. Thanks so much for watching. If you learned something from this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up, comment and don't forget to subscribe. See you in my next video. Bye.